In today's video, we're going to tell you how to fix the LG Dualups resolution versus ergonomics problem. The Dualup has a really high resolution, so to see the text you need to sit really close, but when you sit really close, you have to crane your neck to look up and down, hence ergonomics problem. I'm here today to tell you how to spend your hard-earned money. No, not really, but I am trying to be useful and am telling you what I think is the optimal scaling to run the screen at, and I'm sharing how I use the LG Dualup a little farther away, next to a main screen and share how to set up custom scaling on both Mac and PC. In this quick video, I'm going to share how and show you the results. After this procedure, you will have a dual up that maximizes its screen real estate without being hard on your neck while also making the most use out of it and making the most use out of its expansive, high quality panel. I've used stacked 21 inch monitors for about two years now. In both Mac and Windows, having five screens in a layout like this has worked very well for productivity. A good problem the LG introduces is that even though the sizes are the same, the dual-up resolution is much higher than 21-inch screens normally have. While 21-inch screens usually max out at 1080p, the dual-up is like running two 1440p monitors on top of one another. While having more pixels is good, without telling your computer that the size is the same, all of the text is going to look much smaller, so we need to increase the size of the text and icons and everything else. Windows makes scaling super easy. Windows is built with scaling in mind, so it's as simple as going into settings and moving a slider. Between 1080p and 1440p, the scaling is roughly 33% in each direction. On Windows, I would run my 1080p monitors at 125%. This means that to achieve a similar result in terms of size and eye comfort, we multiply 1.33 by 1.25 and get 66%. We select 50%, which is a solid option because I always thought 25% on 1080p was just a bit too big. On macOS, things are almost just as easy, but we do need to install an app. We install an app called Better Display, which lets you move a slider to adjust the resolution scaling. Natively, macOS scaling is really bad because as opposed to Windows, it's not built from the ground up to support scaling smoothly. The app Better Display fixes that and it costs $20, but it's the best $20 you'll ever spend. Go into settings once you have the app and enable flexible scaling. In the drop-down slider, select 66 to see what 1080p scaled at 125% is, and 1568 by 1764, or 61%, for a nice, usable resolution. If you were to do this without the Better Display app, and picked a resolution from the macOS settings instead, you would see a blurry image as macOS struggles with scaling. I hope future versions of macOS cater better to productivity folks, but I digress. Hopefully in this succinct video, you were able to gather how to scale the dual-up display to make it a nice, informative side display to put information on. I still think the main display should be a 32 inch because it's expansive and lets you accomplish your main task, but the dual has a perfect niche on the sides of a main 32 inch as a perfect secondary task display. Obviously, this is one man's opinion who thinks the setup he recommended fits many, but not all people's use cases. I'm sure there are use cases out there that don't fit this recommendation that I have shared in today's video. If you have a unique setup, I'd love to see. Share your thoughts in the comments below if you run yours differently, or if this video has helped, and thanks for watching.